There are some objects that mostly anyone can recognize. A camera, a laptop, and a gaming system. And though the common uh, similarity between them are they're all electronic devices, what are some other connections that we can make from these objects? Well, we could always say that you could use a laptop to go online shopping. And since this is such a big thing, you could use your laptop to get a gaming system or a camera. And while that's all fun and games, no pun intended there, um, why don't we look at some larger connections that we can make from a camera, a laptop, and a gaming system. Gaming systems have become more and more powerful as they develop. What used to be very simple has grown into something amazingly powerful. With the powers of computers and cameras, the gaming system, have, has, system has grown into something that could be described as an interactive movie. And there are so many types of games, such as online gaming, first-person shooter, third-person shooter, mobile games, alternative reality, role-playing games, computer games, narrative games, puzzles, and so on and so on. With all these types of games being created, a lot of work needs to be put into this. And with that, all that work comes the help of cameras and laptops. They help improve the visuals of the games, and it makes it more real. Cameras and laptops help, help improve graphics and emotional realities that modern games are trying to display. Unlike cameras and laptops, gaming systems are very dependent. They need games to run. And that's not a bad thing because that adds a lot of creativity. But how do laptops and cameras play a role in game creation? A laptop is where it stores and edits games. Whether you are a professional game curator for a great gaming company or you're just making games for fun. Laptops provide access to software that allows you to create games at any time and without these people would not know what games are because they would not exist. Some of the softwares are known as Dark Basic or Dark Basic Pro, Game Maker, Game Editor, Mongi, Mongin, Scratch, and more. Gaming systems are important because there are consoles that allow games to be played, so, and there are so many times, such as the PlayStation, Wii, Xbox, and even the Oculus Rift, which is a ta the newest type of gaming system that lets you basically go inside the game and feel like you're in the game itself. Cameras play a role in game creation in a different way. Cameras either work outside the game, which is basically sends your body, such as a connect, and detects it, and checks your movement. And inside the game, which basically is different points of views you can see the game in. If you're looking at the game in first person point of view, you are very much in the game. You are the person and it's very 3D. Or you're playing in a very two-dimensional plane, such as this one. And you are basically looking at the plane in a flat way. You know what? I think what we need right now is a bit of music to lighten the mood. This one, on the other hand, is very detailed and you feel as if you are in the game itself. Without one, the others would not be able to create such a great, amazing games. So the camera, a laptop, and the gaming system all play a great role in game creation.